Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you can see very clearly, I am on my way to Thailand in this video and I really like the way my last video turned out to be, the Jaipur video where I share tips and tricks with you. So that's why I decided to make, I mean, few vlogs. So this is the first one obviously because this is like my first time i wanted to do really touristy things so the first tour was the maya bay slash fifi island tour so the pricing of these tours always varies on different circumstances you can always ask for a better price you can always bargain there are different types of tours going to fifi so you're gonna select what type of tour you want is it going to be action-packed is it going to be more chill like sightseeing and also it depends on the type of boat that you take so if it's like a really big boat a lot of people so obviously the price is gonna go down if you take like a smaller boat faster boat speed boat so the prices go up third or main thing would be the season so october when i went there it was supposed to be off season but there were just so many tourists so i don't know so if you go like on like peak season like december january i'm pretty sure the prices are gonna go one thing I do want to mention is that island weather is unpredictable. When you take these tours towards these different islands and places, the weather or the water could behave differently from day to day. So even if you have like a bunch of lists in your itineraries, you would miss some of these things that's, that's in the itinerary. So you cannot really be mad at that. Most of these trips include an itinerary like this and this will have every information that you need what your trip is going to be like, where you're going to start, where it's going to end depends on high tide, low tide and whatever like the weather they're going to uh, shift around a little but mostly this is going to be your itinerary so the morning of the tour you go to your hotel lobby and basically wait for your car that's gonna pick you up if you live near patong beach so they will pick a lot of people and you will go with a group of people to the port where they will give you information about the day and everything and then off you go to your boat So the first stop for us was the legendary and the famous Maya Bay where the water is so pretty. We stopped there for like 45 minutes at the park and the tickets are usually included. And yeah, this is how it looks like. It was so pretty and the sun was out. But you're not supposed to like swim in the water, but I really didn't mind it. He was mostly taking pictures, enjoying the ambiance, the water, and the pictures do not even do justice. Obviously, this place is made really famous because of this movie called The Beach starring Leonardo DiCaprio. And after the most beautiful time at Maya Bay, we move on to snorkeling and swimming at Pile Lagoon. Really tried snorkeling, I did, but after like the second failed attempt, I just gave up. sightseeing at Viking Cave and then it was Monkey Bay it was also sightseeing apparently these monkeys are like very unique and only found here and they swim apparently these are really like quick stops and then we move on to our buffet lunch at Fifi Don we had lunch at the bigger island it was so pretty and peaceful I wished we were staying there Oh, 
stop. Off to our final stop is the Kainok Island. You're basically supposed to just relax and try to snorkel if you want. We found this really cute, I don't know, like a crab or something that was hiding in the shell. So yeah, that was the tour was all about. Some essentials that you want to carry with you, like swimwear, sunglasses, hat, SPF, some cash and of course your camera two things that i wanted to add to the list which is a beach towel and extra set of clothes to change because as you can see in this video i was so wet and cold by the time i was going back So the package that we booked, it was more like the chill version, sightseeing, less activity kind of thing. Maximum, there were like 30 people or even less. And the boat was so clean. There was a toilet on the boat. The pamphlet mentions what the tour includes. And it mentions there's hotel transfer. That is true. There are snorkeling equipments. Yes. Certified tour guide. Yes. National park tickets included. Yes. Lunch at a local restaurant. Yes. Life jackets. Yes. Drinks and snacks on board hell yes the total for the trip was 3000 high baht per person so that was all about maya bay i hope this video was informative and useful for you guys the next video will be about the james bond island tour so stay tuned for that so now that it's like peak season in thailand there will be a lot of people going to thailand so i hope you have a wonderful time if you have any more questions definitely leave it in the comment 80 or 90 percent of you guys watch my videos but don't subscribe so please subscribe this year and help this creator grow that is it for today and i'll see you in my next one toodles